So, dear colleagues, welcome to the press conference. We have today three beautiful ladies who are working on a very interesting project these years. Uh, this is a documentary uh, which is called The en Encounter and uh, it's devoted to the Georgian chess phenomenon. I would like to introduce, first of all, the director of this project. It's Tatia Hirtladze. Also, also, we have uh, Anna Hazaradze, co-director of, of this uh, movie and the producer. And we have Nino Chichua, uh, who is a producer. So, as, as far as I know, the project uh, has started many years ago. And uh, who, how actually you came out uh, with this idea and uh, Okay, what happened? I mean, and when all this started? I mean, thank you for inviting and interviewing us. Uh, the film, the idea of film uh, came because of two, two, because of two reasons. One of them is that I grew up in the time where um, the Georgian female chess players, uh, at that time, Soviet Georgian female chess players, were very strong. Uh, and kind of um, very much um, shape the reality of women in Georgia. And the second reason maybe is that I'm living outside of Georgia in Austria and um, my, for me, kind of identification with my country in a way um, happened through these women. So and um, so the women are of course Nona Gaprindashvili, Nana Alexandria, Maya Chiburdanidze, and Nana Yoseliani. These are four women who were who lived in one city. Um, they they uh, played against each other and they played as one Soviet uh, female team. Okay, together. As I know, this project is it's international project, first of all. So Austria, uh, Serbia, and also uh, Georgia, of course, uh, taking part in it. And how happened that uh, all these countries joined it? And uh, what kind of support are you getting from the countries who would like to answer this question? What? The, pro the project was presented um, in Serbia, it was pitched there and it got uh, Best Pitch Award. It was uh, the presentation of an idea before we started production of the project. Then came Georgia, we applied for uh, production funding to the National Georgian Film Center and uh, we got uh, funding from there. And next was Austria. Uh, we applied there, our uh, Austrian co-producer applied there and um, got the production funding from the uh, Ministry of Culture in Austria. So it means that um, all these different countries believed in us and in our project and thought that it was important to tell it. So, yes. Um, just to tell a little bit more about this documentary, what kind of... Um, uh, let's say interesting episodes you found. What kind of materials you found? Uh, which uh, maybe something unique what you have in this documentary? If you ca if you may speak about it, I don't know. Maybe some some facts should be still um, not open. You can start maybe to add something. Uh, what is interesting? What is episodes? So we try to focus on the life of. Uh, these female chess players, not just in the past. We want to work with them now in present. After uh, they are not any more chess stars, world famous chess stars, they are uh, women just living their lives in a normal let's say, way, and we try to uh, capture their lives in this. This is a very important part of the, our film. And maybe to talk about the episode, which is could be funny or interesting. Uh, I mean, we have a story, uh, let's say, love story of Bobby Fischer with Nana Alexandria. Have you heard about that? No. <laughs> yeah. No, it's 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 a story which never happened, but <laughs> it could have happened because there is a somebody who tells this story. <laughs> 
Maybe you have an uh, other idea? Um, uh, one interesting fact that we are including in our film is, um, as we call it, other women. And these women are the namesakes of uh, the four main protagonists that we have, Nonna, Nana, Mai and Nana. And we are, throughout the film, uh, we're looking for these women who were named after, for example, Maya winning the world championship. And then every kid um, um, would have been called Maya or other times Nona. So we're trying to find these women in the film and uh, make the encounter happen between our protagonists and uh, these other women. So I think it's um, one interesting lines that we have in our narrative of the documentary. Thank you for sharing with us some secrets and I see there is some intrigue already in this movie which I mean we had no idea about. Um, I know that you are not playing chess. I used to be a chess player before and for me Georgian women players, especially th those four, were like, I don't know, idols of course in our childhood and uh, of course, it was a long discussion how happened this Georgian phenomenon, how happened that all these ladies at one point, those who were born in, in one city, they actually, in one country, they represented the whole Soviet Union and they won Olympiads. I don't know, have you came close to the question and the answers, how actually this could happen? How, what, what is special about Georgia, Georgian women, that they are so strong in chess? that there are so, I know, strong personalities and characters. Have you found any answers? Mm, um, so I would say that um, um, the, to find the answers was never the in, intention of this film. Because it's very hard to say it's like that, it is the truth. And this is, I think this process and this picture of these female characters uh, will give an answer. And let's say, let's leave it, um, uh, don't talk about that. We, we said a lot of about content, our film, and we will see how the film will answer maybe your question. Yeah? Okay, that's cool. And uh, by the way, what about, um, I don't know, uh, for the new generation, what kind of, um, what would you like, what message are you trying also to send them, to show them with this uh, movie? And uh, the second question is, of course, when it's going to be ready and when can we see it? So, well, about the release of the film, it will be released in 2019, that's what we are hoping. But for a new generation, I would say that this uh, film is very timely because uh, nowadays the issue of women and strong women, uh, stories of strong women, strong females is very timely and everyone is interested in exploring those stories and I think for a new generation these women are very inspirational and uh, this is like a perfect time for a movie like this. Um, and I think except for uh, the timeliness of the film it's a human story about women, their relationship um, and uh, also the fact that not Everybody from our generation knows about the four strong, powerful women who made Georgia famous one time. It's a chance to, to introduce them to the young generation because they used to be famous and now they are famous, but not as they used to be. So that's also one message that we're trying to tell their human story and also the fact that they used to be superstars. And we try to reconnect this let's say Georgian phenomenon to the to the let's say international in, in context in the international context that it's kind of global story and not the story just uh, localized in our country the fact also that they played uh, for Soviet Union team shows in how, ma how many countries they were representing even at that time and uh, I believe that Okay, in the chess world, believe me, they're still very well known and uh, we keep our memories quite well and we try to share it. I mean, for example, in the chess school I studied, we always had portraits of Maya and Nona in front of us all the time. They're former world champions, so we just like, I was born with these portraits in my mind. <laughs> I mean, if I can say so. Uh, in uh, Ukraine, uh, just normal, regular chess school. And 
such kind of portraits we used to have in old chess school still. So you can always find them and see them. And uh, now we have World Chess Olympiad here and uh, all those ladies, we can see them here and it's really nice that uh, they have found time and that they are here with us also supporting this Olympiad. What are your impressions of being here? Have you recorded something connected to the Olympiad too? I don't know. I think um, the aura here is very here is very interesting with uh, so many countries that came together um, in Batumi to 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 play chess. And uh, well, it's my first time being uh, at this type of Olympiad, and I think it's um, really mesmerizing to see so many minds sitting in one huge room and thinking for hours and hours about playing. And of course, we are filming here. Um, some scenes for our documentary and um, yes I would add that we had uh, we kind of are lucky working on our film we got to know that uh, Olympiad will be in Batumi <laughs> where our uh, main protagonists are like a host and we filmed the first playing day it was 24th of uh, September and we filmed very interesting scenes with them. Of course, in the and background was this international event, which kind of really supports our film uh, in order to kind of put it on an international scale. How do you say? Would you like to add something about the movie, something to share with us, or we basically spoke about it? Sorry. Yes. Okay. So everything we will see, I hope, in 2018, and uh, that would be really great. I wish you all the best with this project. Strong ladies trying to show to show the movie about strong ladies. I think it's already great. And thank you so much for coming here, and all the best. Thank you.